Hi guys, I am Wizarding World YouTuber Victoria McLean and I have come here to the Platform 9 of the Quarters. Uh, apparently there's some new stuff going on so I'm going to go and have a look. Would you like to come with me? Yeah? Okay, let's go. <laughs> We're going in. Hi. Hello. <sighs> Hello. Butter beer. Yummy, yummy, yummy. Oh, wow, well, it's lush. I don't want. I've got this. I've got that. I've got that. I've got that. Uh, I love this glass. Ah, oh, tea towels. What have we got down here? We've got more cases of butter beer in case uh, the three broomsticks runs out. Ah, oh, I love these glasses. They are so beautiful. Dun, 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 dun. Oh, wow, look at that. Hey, it's Ravenclaw season. Look at this. <laughs> they did it just for me. <laughs> yeah, it's Ravenclaw season over there. Oh. Am I allowed to have like everything and anything? Is it just like, can I just get, can I get like, um, you know, Hermione's bag and put everything in it that I want? I'll pay for it. But I want everything. Chocolate frog. You know, right? With Harry, he grabs a chocolate frog from the back, and he always manages to find a rare card every single time. He's so he's got this gift. Must admit, if you haven't tried the chocolate frogs in the UK, I highly recommend them because the chocolate is so much more creamier than in America. Don't get me wrong, I love Americans, I love everything about it, it's just the chocolate isn't as sweet as ours in the UK. In fact, I've heard some Americans actually struggle with our chocolate because they find it too sickly, which I can understand. Oh my God, look at these birdie bots. They've completely changed the packaging. Well, that's new. Look at that! I may have to get one because I, that needs to go on my honeydew shelf. Absolutely lovely. Oh, I like these. Look at these notebooks. Marauders Map notebooks. That's very different. I haven't seen that before. I love the little tag on it as well. Mischief Managed. Little metal tag. That's very nice. And then we have some... Uh, Glittery top, sir. What does that say on it? Mischief managed on one side and then the lightning bolt upside down. That's wicked. Hey, baby. I love that bag. It's in the bag down there. It's like an envelope. You're telling me about a bag? Oh, yeah, but you know what I'm like with bags. I had these pajamas. I'm not going to lie, they are so comfy. And I have that dressing gown. It is just to die for. I don't have that bag though. I need that bag next. That's what I need. See here, you can have photographs done on the trolley outside and you get them printed here and then put into an envelope and you have got that wonderful, wow. That bag, Monica, you shouldn't have. <laughs> that bag is stunning. Look at that. That is, you know, that's a lovely, like, if you've got kind of like a black outfit and you don't know what to pair it with. That is gorgeous. Love, love, love. Oh, the Bertie Bots Overflow Beans, they've changed the packaging, so I've got to get one. Ooh. Do you want to pick one up? Uh, Just yes, please. Anyway. Yeah, that'd be great. I love these little bags, but they are expensive. Yeah. They are, don't tell anybody, but they are expensive. They are a little bit pricey, but I think they are proper leather, I'm not sure. But they were always quite pricey, those ones. We've got Janice's favorite character. It's a gorgeous Dobby, look at him. 
there it is that one is pricey I don't know where the price is for it though there is no price but that is beautiful very beautiful I love the red I think these are exclusive to the platform nine three quarter shop as well but you I think you can buy them online so you've got some lovely tops now I'm sticking to purely officially licensed items. I think I might have to invest in some new tops. What do you think? Yeah? yeah. I love the blue. That's gorgeous. That hoodie is stunning. £40. I'm actually impressed with that. That's not a bad price. Love that. That is really lovely. Gorgeous t-shirt to go with it as well. Yeah, that's the one. Look at that. Oh my god, look at this Niffler section. Look at that little Niffler top. Oh, that is so cute. Ages three to four. I want grandkids just so I can dress them up in Niffler stuff. Look at that. Look at this. I've got this bag and he is just the most perfect Niffler ever. And these Nifflers, out of all the ones you can buy, are the best Nifflers ever. They are so beautifully detailed and they look so real in fluffy, in your fluffy, plushy kind of lovable, huggable style. But they are the best Niffler you can get. And I love these mugs. Niffler, and it's got a little Niffler trying to get, there's a little coin at the bottom of that, a little Niffler coin and he's trying to get it. And then you've got obviously Janice's favourite, Spew with a little Dobby on the top. He is adorable. Oh, it's a little Hedwig waiting for my letter, aren't we all? That t-shirt is beautiful. I love the pattern on that. No, not yet. That is so different. God, that's so thick. I love all the detail you've got at the top. properly trying to immerse you in the wizarding world in this shop it's lovely and you don't have to pay to come here you know you don't have to go it's not like you with the the tour you have to have a ticket to go to the one in the tour you can come here anybody can come here and it's free oh well, there's Griff yeah look Gryffindor oh I get it it's all of them in for me I mean I'm, I'm rare but I'm not that amazing my other house Slytherin okay I'm quite happy to say that I am both I love those mugs they are massive oh my god they're 12 pound look at the size of that to my hand that's huge that is ginormous that's not bad for 12 pound Oh, look at that baby grow. We got one for our friend Farron, we did. It's so adorable. Harry's got these gloves as well. They are amazing. I've got the Ravenclaw version. Oh, and for all the pin badge lovers, just look at all of them. Now that is a collection of pins. Sorry, my love. Look at all these pin badges. Ah, I get this one. Ah. <laughs> uh, that bottom gem we're gonna drink this though. I like this. Oh, I like that. Chocolate frog on the front. Yeah. And then it's the chocolate frog on the back, the actual, it's cool. isn't it? I love that. Honey Duke's thing on the front and then that on the back. Oh my God, that is the, the tiniest little golden snitch I've ever seen in my life. That is just the cutest thing ever. That really is. $7.99, that is so, it's so cute. And then we've got um, the Tri-Wizard Cup key ring. I've seen a few people have that, that's really nice. And remember, people who've got Wizarding World Gold, you can use your code here, I'll use your pass here for 10% off, I think it is, until October. I've got... Oh, get it. Butterbeer's better when it's alcoholic. Did I just say that? Butterscotch schnapps. I have a bottle at home. 
That is kilt. I like that. But the one I've got is the wrong colour. That actually suits. That actually does suit. Does it? Yeah. I had the first one. The first one was a very light blue. It was that colour blue it was. And it was the wrong blue. It needs to be this colour. So they've done it right now. Love these pens. I have, I think, three of these. I just keep buying them. They are the best it's pens twisty. ever. Yes. Love twisty pen. Love this twisty pen. I had these sent to me as an apology from Warner Brothers. I had all four houses and I can't remember why. But I had all of them. So I love these. Yes, it was the lamp, the... the the illuminator and lamp and all of ours were broken yeah, every time you got one, yeah. yeah so uh, we had f all four pins given to us as a gift these look at the size these bags to my hand it's the what what i know i've got them but the pockets got so was sewn up i need to send them back i keep forgetting to send them back so we've got gryffindor here janice's proud house in case you didn't know, Janice is a Gryffindor. And she likes to tell everyone and show everyone whenever we see her. And when she's coming on Tuesday, she will be covering the house in Gryffindor merchandise and I'll probably be hiding it as soon as she puts it down. <laughs> I love my Hufflepuff stuff. I know you love your Hufflepuff stuff, but it's like, sorry, wait, darling. Oh, the pyjamas. See, it's, you're the reason why I bought the Ravenclaw ones. Oh, look at the jumpers. Look, say hi. I must admit, these don't feel as itchy as the original ones were. I'd have to have Harry, though, rather than Ron. Although Ron would work with my hair better now. Harry would work with my hair better, I think. Yeah. I think. I'm very red in case you hadn't noticed. It's very like rough. I've always wanted to get one, but Same. I don't know if I'd buy I'd wear it. Because they are so thick. Oh, the sword of Gryffindor. By Noble. Such a beautiful replica and one I think every Harry Potter fan should own. I have one and I still haven't got a place to put up yet. <gasps> Look at those stockings! Pardon? What, the stockings? Yeah, I got the Ravenclaw one. I said to Adam, he said, well, I didn't know if the boys would want one. I said, they're Slytherin. He went, oh, no, yeah, they are, aren't they? Oh, man, they're I really loved it. I love the fact that they come with these little charms. Yeah. Because look at that, it's not stunning. They haven't got Slytherin here. Maybe they sold out. Oh, my God, look at the Slytherin one. It comes with a little sword of Gryffindor. And then the Hufflepuff comes with a little cup. That is so cute. It's so cute. So we've got a Deathly Hallows section. Look at these. And if you want some chocolate, there's some more chocolate right here in the form of some green nuts coins. <gasps> yeah. Look at all that shiny gold. Any Niffler would want to get himself in that pile and take it all, stuff it in his pouch. Oh, sorry, darling. Sorry. That's all right, love. Don't worry. Look at those cute little nifflers. I must admit, I have been eyeing up this bag. How much is that? Forty pound. That's actually a very reasonable. You take off the thing. Ah, oh, there's one there that's been taken off. Look at that. Look at the furry wings. Isn't that lush? That is so gorgeous. I love that bag. That is beautiful. Got some house lanyards up there. I do have those. I use all of them. They are brilliant. They're the only brushes I use now. Um, I'm not too keen on the nail varnish. It's the only thing I wouldn't get. The lip gloss makes your lip... It's got like something in it that brings them out so it makes them all a little bit... Yes, it's the one I make it a little bit puckery. That is fantastic nail varnish. Um, Luna eyeshadow topper. Lipstick, lip gloss, seven ninety five. So yeah, these are lovely. These go on top of eyeshadow. Yeah, because it doesn't really. It makes them a little bit more pinker than your lips are. Mine needs to be topped up. So the and nail. Sticky, yes, a little bit. The nail, the nail. I wouldn't 
get those because they don't last five minutes. The eyeshadow is quite nice, the pigmentation is quite thick. Mascara, no. That's nice. That, well, you know, that's great, that one. I like that. Yes, we've got makeup here. Oh, we got some Cursed Child merch. Oh, it's nice to see. Very nice to see. <laughs> I must admit, I think Janice bought this. It is a gorgeous, gorgeous makeup bag. But I've got the new Yule Ball one I have, and it is absolutely stunning. Got some magnets, platform nine three quarters magnets, which actually, because I'm a bit of a niffler myself, caught my eye as well. And then the legendary replica ticket, just so you don't miss your train. So we've got some gorgeous jewellery, stunning time turners, apart from nine three quarters necklaces, earrings, bracelets. Sorry guys, excuse me. And you. some house necklaces. These are like the stockings that we saw, but these are in the form of necklaces. So you've got the locket there, which is beautiful. We didn't have the Slytherin stocking over there. The Ravenclaw necklace, Hufflepuff and Gryffindor. They are beautiful. I'm very tempted with that Ravenclaw one. How much are they? Let's have a look. Oh, it doesn't have it listed. Very strange. Oh, we got some pygmy puffs. I do have to admit, I have got this pygmy buff. He is sat on my shelves at the bottom. He is adorable. Again, it's this bag. Do you know what? I think this bag is trying to tell me that I need to buy it. What do you think, right? That is a stunning Luna Lovegood bag. Thank you very much. I am loving that bag. Absolutely loving that. We've got some house chocolate. The Hufflepuff one is the nicest. Gotta be honest, Hufflepuff one is my favourite chocolate. Don't tell anyone. We've got some Dobby, Dobby merchandise here with some plushy Dobbies. Oh, go on, darling. Sorry. That's all right. No problem. You're welcome. Sorry, excuse me, sorry. <gasps> Monica has just pointed out that they are selling the Yule Ball baubles, okay? The glass ornaments. They've got Yule Ball baby grows. And they don't have these in the studios. They also have the wooden Dumbledore wand as well. No, they're the wooden Dumbledore ones. Yep, deadly serious. They've also got Harry's up there as well. Yeah, they don't have them in the studios. Oh, they've got the carrot shop section. Oh my God. It is beautiful, I love that. I want it all, but it's very expensive. Is that adult one? No, it's kids. Oh, damn. Yeah, so here we have the wooden ones. We've got Harry's. We've got Hermione's. And we've got Dumbledore's. No, the one thing I wanted was the um, the glasses, and I got them. Adam bought them for me for, for Christmas. So they're fifty quid, and they are just thirty-eight. They've gone down in price. Ah, oh, they were fifty. Oh, I, I think I do. How much were they? Them ones. Oh, they're reduced. Nope. Nope, I'm gonna be good. Nope. As much as they are beautiful. Nope. They will get lost on the tree. Oh, they have got Harry Potter wrapping paper though. Look at that. <laughs> About time to. They have the official robes as well. Absolutely beautiful. Oh, look at this one section. Oh, isn't that beautiful? And you can also come here and have a look at the ones. Stunning. They have all of the wooden ones for sale, which is so nice because the last time I went to the studios, they didn't have them there. So, 
bit pricey, aren't they? 60. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I, I, but I have them all, but I had to get them one at a time in like months in, a, you know, different sections. What do you mean you've got them all? I've got them, I've got three of them. Oh. There's only three She's they a do. Little bit obsessed. Yeah. Little bit obsessed, yeah. Oh, right. <laughs> so oh, this is one wand I need to get hold of. I think this is Fred's. Fred Weezy's. I've already got George's, but I need to get Fred's. So that is it. I have a bag full of stuff. Uh, one of it is a bottle of butter beer, which will not be lasting until I get home to Wales. I will make sure that I drink it probably tonight during film, during watching the Batman film, probably. Uh, what was the favourite thing I liked about the shop? They have some really nice exclusive items there, like the wizarding, the wooden wands you can buy here. I mean, you, I didn't realise you can get them here. They are exclusive to Pattern 9 3 quarters, so no wonder I haven't seen them in the shop. In, in in the tour, you know, because I'm like really switched on with all that. Uh, what else did I love? I didn't have my photograph taken on the trolley purely because I feel like I'm in the wrong top. You know, this is frozen and I should be in Harry Potter robes. I'm gonna have a photograph taken, right? But I think they do have robes and a scarf for you to use, but there is a big queue, so I'd rather just give it a miss for today. But I highly recommend you come down. You don't have to pay to come here. That's what I love about it. You can just come to the shop and enjoy the experience. And it is a full experience in that shop. Full of the most magical Harry Potter items, I tell you now. So, until next time, take care. I love you all and I will speak to you very soon. <laughs>